first uh, met Lisa Ann McCall, really a, a major depression in my life. I had firmly convinced myself that I couldn't run anymore. And, you know, I probably to a lot of people that's not a reason for depression, but it had been so much a part of my life and so much of a release and a relief. Uh, and then to have it taken away because of gimpy knees, and, you know, just twerked out body, I thought, it's over. I mean, I was bummed. And she took a look at me and she said, um, what do you want to do again? And I said, I want to run. I want to run again. She said, okay, I'll get you to run again. And slowly, it wasn't uh, an overnight, it wasn't a magic pill, but slowly over time, weeks, you know, passed, maybe a few days, actually a few days passed, and I started walking, and it, I didn't have pain in my knees. She taught me how to reconfigure my body and do weird things with my hips, and I didn't really know what she was asking me to do, but I did it because pain is a very good teacher in my life, and I want to get out of pain, learn the lesson, and move on. And what happened was, you know, the pain started to recede, and... Uh, I started to feel better. And after a couple, three, four weeks, I said, why don't you, instead of walking, why don't you run 10 steps? And I ran 10 steps and, and it didn't hurt. And then I ran 10 more and 10 more. And then I ran a minute and then I walked and then I ran two minutes and then I walked and then I ran three and with her help, I am, uh, I hope I can complete a lifelong dream, which is uh, finishing an Ironman triathlon. Two and a half mile swim, 112 miles on the bike, and then a 26 mile run. And if I do it, it's really because of Lisa Amico. When I'm 